Let me ask you this, because I think parents will want to know this. You said you started out with 20 prep schools that Robert gave you to look at, and you narrowed it down to five. Talk to me on what your research process was and how you narrowed it down. What what factors were you looking at uh, in your due diligence? I mean, mostly in getting Robert's um, point of view, because we didn't know any of those coaches and and him knowing where... CJ in that in the first case and Parker in the second case would fit in. And to, to your point, like, okay, you can be the ninth or 10th guy, but you've got to know that that guy's going to advocate for you. That coach is going to advocate for you. And also when, when my younger son saw CJ go through the process and that he was in the middle of nowhere, he was like, I'm not going to a school in the middle of nowhere. So, you know, it, it be, it's also dependent on the kid. So, yeah. you know, Worcester is a bigger town. It had more going on. It was, you know, it was like when we went and visited, um, I mean, Parker really liked Blair too, which is in the middle of nowhere, but it's a bigger campus. So it, it had a, a bigger feel to it. He actually liked South Kent, but he had just come from an all boys school. And he's like, I don't know that I want to do another year. You know, I've just done four years of high school in an all boys high school. So yeah, vetting kind of came down to just um, talking to the coaches, you know, getting on the phone with each of those coaches, you know, hearing what they thought, of, you know, sending them tape so that they could evaluate Parker if they, you know, if they hadn't. Um, seen him play live, which most of them hadn't. And then knowing if there was a fit. And quite honestly, I think I can say this now, we went to Blair and my son was like, it's this is like um, Harry Potter. I want to come here. And quite honestly, Joe was amazing. And he just said, I'll be honest with you. I just signed a kid from Syracuse. I don't need his position. So like, you know, it was like, oh, okay. So it, it needs to be a, you know, a two-way street. And I'm glad he was that honest with us because yeah. again, it would have been a bummer if he was like, oh, I'm all in on, on going there and him not getting to play, which is the whole point. Like you said, it's, it was, the whole point was to be able to put yourself in a position to get a scholarship or to get a built in college. So 